to the newest citizen that was just sworn in. President Trump talked about swearing in brand new citizens who are now adopted into the house and are on this boat. One thing that the Lord has shown me is that a lot of the elected officials have feared repercussions. which has motivated their decisions to mow my platform over, not care, sh give a shit about my petitions. Oh, isn't it better to mow one man over? Well, let me ask you a question. How many men is the Lord Jesus Christ. He is one. How many am I? I am one. How many are you? You are one. How many men? How many men? is Martin Luther King Jr. whose celebration we honored yesterday. If you expect a, a repercussion for truth and faithfulness you are in hell already because you ain't got the balls or the courage to stand up for the innocent you haven't got the balls or the courage to stand up for the children or the women or those who are sacrificing for our country and being separated from their families and giving service to this country you haven't got the courage to represent them if you think that bullies are gonna have their way against you and the Lord won't stand up with you in faithfulness and truth then you have more faith in Lucifer and you are a follower of the devil and you can expect the Lord Jesus Christ to come out against you in your abomination and Isaiah says your agreement with hell shall be disanaled what does that mean your agreement with hell as children of the devil shall be disanaled think of a stick of dynamite shoved up your ass and lit when you think of the word disanaled in your agreement with hell Think about a stick of dynamite being shoved up your ass and the Lord Jesus Christ lighting the fuse and blowing the motherfucking shit out of you. Is, is that not a reasonable definition of having your agreement with hell, your agreement with the lies your agreement with the deception, your agreement with the devil, your agreement 
against the veterans of this country. Your agreement perpetrating the future of our children. Your agreement in perpetrating wickedness upon the women, the orphans, the widowed, those who need defense. Your agreement with the bottomless pit. Your agreement with Shoal. Your agreement with Beelzebub. That father of all lies. Your agreement will be blown to hell. In truth and faithfulness of the Lord, the Holy One of Israel. Can I make it any plainer? Can I tell you your future? And will you hear me? And will your eyes be opened? to the stick of dynamite that is up your ass right now. Repent. The Lord's hand is extended to you now. Repent. Change course right now today make your commitment to support the Lord's kingdom thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread forgive us our sins as we forgive those who have trespassed against us Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the glory. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Do yourself a favor. Don't call yourself a Christian. Don't call yourself a saint. If you are supporting the devil and uplifting the devil, if your agreement is with hell, don't call yourself a Christian. You hypocrite, if you do, and your reward is with the hypocrites. Go write that down, right now. Today, I understand that I have made an agreement with hell and that I worship and follow the devil, Lucifer. The father of all lies. Or. Go write it down today. I make a commitment to the Lord. In his righteousness. In his holiness. In his faithfulness. And in truth. I will not. Send. Any more contributions. In support of the whore. Of the earth. I will not support and contribute to anyone who is not true and faithful to the United States Constitution.
I want to be a child of God. I want to be a son of God. I want to be a daughter of God. I will support the Lord in his work for the kingdom. Not the church. For the kingdom. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done. Not the church. Come out of the whore of Babylon. Come out of the whore of Babylon. Be ye true and faithful servants and disciples of the Lord Jesus Christ. I'm Cody Robert Judy, and I'll talk to you next.